Hey, I'm James with PNW Outdoor Reviews, the channel for honest and simple reviews. Today we're talking about the Marmot Tactical Flashlight. Now this is just a very simple aluminum bodied LED flashlight, kind of has a gloss black finish to it, uh, uses a rechargeable battery, and it's not adjustable at all. You cannot actually adjust the zoom or anything like that. It has more of a spotlight type of beam to it, but again, the light output is actually very good. I, I do like these flashlights. And I say flashlights because eight months ago, if anyone remembers, oops, I reviewed one identical to it. And yes, this isn't the same flashlight. All right, it's hard, it's almost impossible to tell these things apart. Um, this is the Phyland tactical flashlight. The only difference is the, the name changes on the first part of the sentence, right? One's a Marmot tactical flashlight. This one is a Phyland tactical flashlight. So obviously from the exact same manufacturer, just branded differently. Now, the only difference that you can tell between them is a little bit of uh, stipling or cutting in the grip there. One's a little finer than the other, but that's realistically the only difference. And kind of a fun fact, I weighed both of them. Um, the Marmot tactical weighs 4.7. And the Phyland, my older one, weighs 4.8. So again, yeah, basically the exact same weight, but just a tenth of a difference right there. So just kind of like, huh, I, I don't know why one weighs more than the other, but uh, for being, again, identical flashlights. But to talk about the Marmot tactical flashlight today, because I've already talked about the Phyland one, I like this flashlight. I really do. And that's why I was, I said yes to get another one to review. Uh, again, this was offered to me at no charge. I'm not getting paid for this review. This is truly just an honest and simple review. The reason I like these flashlights uh, compared to a lot of the other ones, especially ones that are adjustable, is, I mean, this puts out an actual beam of light. Um, it, it really is like a spotlight, basically. And I'm going to show you uh, an indoor and outdoor demonstration using this exact flashlight. So stay tuned to the end of this video and you'll see all of that in use. The reason I like these flashlights, and again I'm going to say flashlights because they really are identical, but the Marmot Tactical Light, just like the Phyland Light, they come with everything. They come with two of the rechargeable 18650 batteries, comes with the charger itself, and the reason they call it a tactical flashlight is because it has this offset Picatinny mount. So I wish I could have showed you today what that looks like, but the AR-15 that I own has an M-Lock system. I don't actually have a true Picatinny system on it. So that's a goal of mine. We'll save that for another video, right? But this offset mount, again, you can mount to your rifle or shotgun or whatever you may have. And it comes with, a new end cap for the flashlight. So you just screw this on to the end of the flashlight. You can see you got the cord itself with the actual switch itself. So it's got an, it's got two switches in this switch. So you, have, you can turn it on and off and keep it or you can just flash the light. So again, very cool. It just, it just comes, with, comes with everything out of box, ready to go, whether you just want to use it as the everyday flashlight like I do which now this is what I'm going to be keeping in my truck because I still use the Phyland as my bed stand flashlight because it's compact it's super bright and you know it, it really I rarely I've only had to charge the battery once granted I don't use it every day but um, for just sitting on my bed stand for eight months you know and only having to charge the battery once I'm pretty happy with that so I'm hoping to get that same result uh, from the Marmot Tactical, which I imagine I will, but I'll definitely be updating you if anything changes there. So, well, let's go ahead then. Uh, let's switch gears and let's go ahead and just show off what this looks like indoors and then we'll show it off outdoors. So let's go ahead and take a look. To demonstrate the flashlight indoors, let's say like a power outage or I don't know, maybe you don't have lights in the shed and you need to find something. This flashlight really, again, does the job. This is why I keep this one on my bed stand now, just because it works. You know, a nice solid spotlight beam, uh, very, you know, bright in the center there, so great at distance, but you know, all around it, you got a lot of light. So again, if you're looking for something, such as your dog, there she is, hi. 
don't mean the blinder but again a lot of light in a pretty tiny flashlight so this just to demonstrate how well it does in pitch black this is what you're looking at so let's go ahead then and let's take this outdoors all right so now we're outside and we'll go ahead and demonstrate the flashlight here along the fence line so it really does light up my backyard plenty you know i can really see what i'm looking at and definitely see a dog that really wants to play catch even in the dark endless energy but this light does very well indoors outdoors i really need water here but again it, it really does light up what you're looking at so yeah hopefully this is enough of a demonstration for you guys uh I really can't say how much I appreciate you for checking out my videos and just being a huge supporter of the channel. So thank you to everybody uh, and I want you to have a great day.